Paint can transform a room, but painting over cracks and holes won't make them disappear. It may even make them more noticeable. So it's important to do it right and fix them before you start painting. Here's what you'll need. A putty knife, sanding block, a sponge, a brush, spackle, hammer, and primer. Fixing minor holes and cracks isn't hard. If you plan to move or remove wall hangings, the holes should be repaired. Use a utility or putty knife to widen the cracks and remove any loose material. Create a trench that's a little deeper and slightly larger than the crack. Another common issue that requires repair is nail pops, where sheetrock nails have popped up and now show. These need to be countersunk by hitting them with a hammer. To prevent it from happening again, put sheetrock screws into the stud on each side of the nail pop. Next, brush or vacuum the area to remove dust or debris. You may also use a damp cloth. If you don't remove the dust and clear the area, it can affect how well the filler dries and grips the surface of the wall. Use spackle or joint compound as filler. Start by loading your putty knife with filler material. With even pressure, slide the putty knife over the area to be filled. Depending on the depth of the hole or crack, you may need to repeat this a few times. Make sure that each layer dries before adding another one. After the filler has fully dried, lightly sand with fine grade sandpaper, then wipe with a damp cloth or sponge and make sure it's fully dry. Use a good primer paint like Benjamin Moore Fresh Start on all repaired areas to seal the filler and to help prevent it from absorbing the new paint. That's how to fix cracks and holes the right way. If you have any other projects in mind, we can help. Visit your local Benjamin Moore retailer, go to benjaminmoore.com, or check out our other how-to videos.